Hello and welcome to the channel viewers. My name is Tenerife Tez and we're going to take a little walk round uh, Player Las Americas and I'll show you where uh, one or two of the places are. This is going to lead up to the Columbus and the Barranca. A very very popular area just around here. A few shops and bars across the other side of the road, supermarkets, just about everything you need up and down this uh, little bit of the walkway. What we got there? Uh, yep, yeah, chicken life. Takeaway chicken burgers, etc. One of those uh, ATM machines. Just be careful of the exchange rate on some of these. The uh, supermarket, of course. Here's a nice restaurant. Let me know if you've eaten here at all. There you go. Cocktails and a sish. Have you been there? One or two other bars here as well, the Hong Kong uh, restaurant. That's a very nice place to eat. You'll not be disappointed the uh, meals that they serve in there. Enjoy. Plenty of choice for everybody as well. What else we got? More restaurants here. Plenty, same as I say, plenty of choice. Fish and steaks. Have you eaten at that one? There's one thing in Tenerife. There's plenty of uh, food for everybody. Do you know what this bar is? This is the Old English Rose. Was uh, part of carriages at one time. Now it is just all the Old English Rose. These do good food as well. And uh, reasonably priced cheap beer. Let me know if you've been there at all. That is very, very popular little bit of an excursion place at the side as well. Just opposite is the Irish Anchor Bar as you can make out but uh, we'll take a quick walk across the road. The building opposite is the El Dorado. Have you been there at all? These apartments are available on Airbnb and uh, other type uh, websites. Yeah the apartments are good value for money and uh, very locally placed to the player and lots and lots of bars like the Giddy Goose etc etc and the bars that we've just walked past uh, across the other side of the road. So let me know your thoughts on that place. But we'll uh, continue on. Not a lot to see for a few hundred yards but uh, nevertheless it gives you an idea of the place. The white building on the other side of the road is the Barranca which is a two-star accommodation with uh, one of those little infinity pools just across the front. That's uh, the supermarket just below there. The top building is the uh, Tajanistes, if I've pronounced that correctly. And uh, you also see those available on the uh, local websites. Bollywood Tandoori there, very nice. Give that one a go as well and one of those little uh, Aladdin's Cave Bazaar Chinese shops there. Seem to have something for everybody inside there. So uh, if you've forgotten something on your holiday possibly that's the place to go. Another one there, little uh, Asian supermarket and the infamous Jersey Cow there. Lots and lots of karaoke if that's your sort of thing. Sometimes they have acts on there. But it uh, looks like Rod Stewart, but um, not as many acts as what they used to do. But they do have compares, etc., etc. Yeah, as you can see, there's the Barranca. Have you stayed there at all? Let me know your thoughts on that. If you like uh, videos of Tenerife and surrounding areas, the touristy areas, I uh, do quite a few of these and walkthroughs at some of the hotels and apartments. It gives you a good idea as to what is available if you're looking to actually come on holiday over here and uh, possibly melt, makes your mind up as to uh, what area you would like to stay in. So uh, taxi rank just there and the Columbus Hotel. We'll uh, go across the crossing and uh, take another look and see what else is over here. So please think about subscribing, it's absolutely free and it does not cost you a penny and it really helps out the channel. There are a couple of supermarkets here, the Dial Pre just here, new sports bar on top of it where the umbrellas are, you can just make those out. 
at this supermarket you can get freshly made sandwiches to take with you to the airport so you don't have to pay the fantastically high priced uh, food prices at the airport just before you get into the taxi and uh, leave for the airport. Another view of the El Dorado just across the other side of the road. Two major bus stops here, one on each side of the road of course. This one is a direct bus route from the airport to this area which is bus 40. Oh and there is the Chieftain. The bus 40 by the way is a limited stop bus so within uh, 20 minutes or so you actually arrive here at this destination so if you do not want to pay the uh, expensive prices or are the expensive affordable maybe of the taxi fares you can jump on the bus and get here within a few minutes as that is a cheaper way of uh, transporting you from the airport and the cost is very very cheap let me know if you've done that before. I'm sure lots and lots of people have done that. Marshall's sports bar just tucked away down there as well. Specials there. What we got here, a rent a car as well. There's the uh, California across the other side of the road as well. You can make that out. And at the far side is the Tikatan. Another view of the El Dorado. So I would like to thank you for watching the video, I do hope you've enjoyed it and I will uh, see you in the next one.